Pran, thank you. And next up today, how did Bill's owners, Kim and Terry Pagula, come to the conclusion that Orchard Park would be the best place for a new football stadium? Well, today we have a better idea of how they came to that decision. After some research, the Pagulas paid for was made public for the first time. Steve Brown has been sifting through those documents and is here with the story. It's like a package we're opening already today, Steve. <laughs> yeah, an early Christmas gift to reporters. <laughs> Hi, Kate. Yeah, four documents in all, all research either paid for or produced by the Bills organization in their quest for a new stadium. They include pictures or renderings of what the new stadium could look like. This is one of a new stadium at the Bills preferred location. That's an Orchard Park across from Abbott Road, across Abbott Road from the current home of the Bills which is, of course, Highmark Stadium. And based on comments from Governor Kathy Hochul this week, it appears she's quite okay with that venue. If Orchard Park's their first choice, their only choice, it's Orchard Park, and uh, we'll make it all happen. So uh, we're very excited about uh, announcing a deal, hopefully in the near future. Now, in its research, the Bills did take a long look at another site in the old First Ward. Here's a rendering of what that might look like with Lake Erie in the background. Pretty nice looking. But here's a comparison of the cost of the two sites from the Bills research. The estimated price of the so-called South Park site, just shy of $2 billion. In Orchard Park Stadium, about a billion and a half. But that South Park price, that's just for the stadium, does not include road, sewage, water, and other improvements that would be necessary. Also, the Bills research estimates that building in the old First Ward would take two years longer to build, not open until the 2027 season. The estimated ready date for the Orchard Park location, two seasons earlier, fall 2025. Now, all these documents were shared with the state government and the Pagulas gave permission to have them posted for everyone to see. If you would like to take a look at that Bill Stadium research for yourself, the documents are attached to this story on our website, WGRZ.com. Kate, next hour we'll have part of the Pagulas research that may get people questioning why the Orchard Park site was picked over downtown Buffalo. Back to you. Certainly a question I know a lot of people have. So Absolutely. look forward to that, Steve. Thank you.